Elon Musk, the man that can land two rockets at the same time, the person that's going to get the first human beings on Mars, and the person that has absolutely revolutionized the electric car industry. But in this video, I'm going to see whether Elon Musk can do SEO. I'm going to be doing an SEO audit on the Boring Company's website, which is one of Elon Musk's companies, as you can see here, boringcompany.com. Now this site is actually built on Squarespace and I made the SEO plugin and the audit tool for Squarespace and we're gonna be putting it through the test, seeing if Elon Musk can do all of this wizardry in other businesses, but fails with SEO. Now I think this is super important as well because we can see that the boring company gets over 120,000 visitors a month, but more importantly, it ranks position two for flamethrower in the US. So we're gonna see what Elon Musk can do to rank position one in the US for flamethrower and ultimately get more people to find the boring company. But let's get straight at it. All I need to do is go to seospace.co.uk, create an account and then add this site in here. So the boringcompany.com. Then it's gonna tell us the pages on that website and give us the option to skip any, which you may wanna do if there's like a terms and conditions or privacy policy page, etc., that we want to skip. And as you can see, there's not actually that many pages on the Boring Company's website. So all we need to do is press next step. We obviously can't connect Google Search Console because as much as I'd love to, I don't have access to Elon Musk's Google account just quite yet. So we'll just skip this. We obviously don't need to watch the tutorial because I made SEO space before then starting the SEO audit. So SEO space is just gonna go through every single page on Elon Musk's website to give it an SEO score and figure out what Elon Musk is doing wrong with his SEO. So come on, Elon, don't let us down. At least show us that you can do your SEO. So as you can see here, SEO space is off to the races and it's quickly going through all of the boring company's web pages in order to give it the SEO score. And as soon as it's finished, this will change to see report and we can see Elon Musk's SEO score. So as you can see here, the SEO audit on the boring company is finished. So we can just press see results and it's gonna show us the health score. Elon, Elon, Elon. You can literally land two rockets at the same time, but you or your team can't get your SEO score above 25 out of 100. Come on, mate, you need to sort that out. So as you can see here, Elon Musk's SEO score is 25 out of 100. Elon, mate, you're letting the SEO industry down. What are you doing? So just scrolling down, we can see we can't get all of the details because as I said, I can't, I'm not connected to Google Search Console, so I can't see if pages aren't indexed. But you can see there's 18 pages missing meta descriptions, 18 pages with SEO titles too short. Fortunately, there's no broken links, but you can see meta descriptions, SEO titles needs a lot of work. And as you can see here, these are the individual scores of each page. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna find a few in order to see the detailed results on Elon Musk's website. So we're gonna take the Not Effect Flamethrower. That's definitely a page that we're going to be going through. We'll also take the Vegas Loop page. Interesting to see how that's doing, as well as competition. And then why not, we'll also take the home page. So we've got three pages here, the Not a Flamethrower page, the Vegas Loop, the competition page, which as you can see is quite interesting. I don't know if I'm meant to be finding this page on Elon Musk's website, but there we are. And then also the home page. So first of all, the not a flamethrower page. And, and as I've already told you, the not a flamethrower page ranks position two in the US for flamethrower. So I'd say it's pretty natural that Elon Musk would probably wanna rank higher up on Google in order to move his electric car and business world domination over to SEO domination. So we've just added this keyword to SEO space and it's gonna tell Elon Musk step-by-step step what to do to rank position one on Google for flamethrower. We could then also go through this Vegas loop page, which again is super interesting. And SEO space is telling us exactly what we need to do. As you can see, this page doesn't even have a meta description. So if we get Vegas loop and we put it in on Google, 
You can see here that the boring company is already ranking on page one. However, this is the meta description. So you can see that the boring company isn't actually controlling what is showing on search engines because they don't have a meta description in place. So there's a lot of things that need to be doing. You can see that it doesn't even have an SEO title, which is an absolute shocker. It also doesn't have any H1s of all things. So there's no headings. It's got thin content. So again, there's a lot of things that need to be done here and it doesn't have enough internal links to other pages. So Elon Musk is the man that can land someone on Mars but can't even fill out his meta description. So moving on to not a boring competition. This looks like an internal page or some sort of promotional page. So we're gonna skip that because it's not really for SEO before then completing a scan on the boring company's homepage to see what the score is. So as you can see here, even on Elon Musk's homepage, there's a lot of things SEO wise that need to be improved. His homepage has more than one H1. So again, that is bad for SEO. The SEO title is too short. So again, if you type in the boring company, you can see that there's a lot of things that can be done in order to get the boring company showing up better, i.e. controlling their meta description, controlling their SEO title to basically control how the boring company's brand is shown up on Google. There's also images that need to be compressed. These images are far too big, as well as external links that need to be set in new tab. Again, that is bad because if someone goes down and they click straight on the LinkedIn page of the boring company, Google would see that they've come on this page and they've left immediately to go to another page. So that again, the page's meta description is too short. But now we've finished that, what we're gonna do, we're gonna tell Elon Musk how to rank position one in the US for Flamethrower. And as you can see here, SEO Spaces SEO plugin is telling Elon Musk exactly what to do to improve his Squarespace SEO and rank higher for Flamethrower. As you can see, this page doesn't have any H1s and therefore it doesn't have the main keyword in the H1. It doesn't have a meta description. So all Elon Musk would have to do in order to change this is go onto the settings of this page, go to SEO and then fill out 150 to 160 words character meta description with the term flamethrower in and I'm pretty sure that it'd have a high chance of outranking Wikipedia because as you can see here it's currently ranking position two so there's plenty of work that Elon Musk needs to be done he could even generate this with AI using SEO space I would even argue that I'm educating Elon Musk the man himself on how to use AI there's bad word counts to so this thin content on this page Elon mate what are you doing you can't even write over 300 words on your web page you can see that there's links that aren't set to open new tab his seo title isn't long enough so if elon musk wanted to get a better share for the 135 thousand people a month that search flamethrower and rank above wikipedia on google seo space is literally educating elon musk on exactly what to do as it also has eye icons through every step of the journey with short tutorials from myself. So Elon, if you're listening up and you wanna learn about Squarespace SEO, you need to watch these videos. So Elon, there's a lot of work to do. And as again, we can see on the SEO space dashboard, Elon Musk's The Boring Company has an SEO score of 25 out of 100. So if I was doing the SEO for Elon Musk, I know he is on a little bit of a tight budget at the moment after buying Twitter, I would get started on SEO Space's seven day free trial. I would go through each page step by step, select the keyword that we want to rank for and optimize that web page for those keywords. And what this means is Elon Musk could get more eyeballs on his project and get more traffic to his website outside the other marketing channels that he's using. So Elon, if you're watching this, thank me later and sign up for a seven day free trial on SEO space. And of course, for everyone else that isn't Elon, feel free to subscribe to this YouTube channel where I cover lots of Squarespace SEO tips and tell you how to rank your Squarespace website like Elon Musk's higher up on Google. So thanks a lot, guys. I'll see you in the next video.